Hey y'all, it's me, DKP, and welcome to my channel. I'm giving you this beautiful, glossy, red Valentine's Day makeup look. Um, the glossy list really used to be popular back in the day, so I just thought, you know, I kind of like bring it back for the girls a little bit. Um, I absolutely love this look. I, mm, I don't know what to say. Just get into this. Oh, I promise you, you're going to love it. Give it a try. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let's get into the video. Hey, y'all. Let's jump right into it. First thing we're going to do is work on our brows. I'm going to use this NYX eyebrow gel to go ahead and gel my eyebrows down so they can stay put. Okay, so while that's drying down, I'm gonna move into the face moisturizer using the Aveeno Daily Face Dry Skin Moisturizer and also the gel. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and fill in my brows with this beauty supply <laughs> eyebrow pencil. I know, I know, I'll be going to Ulta today, okay? Cause I'm already like out of primer. <laughs> so I'll be making that trip today. But let's go ahead and fill them in. So I'm going to be using my uh, NARS concealer in Deep Chocolate and ooh, Juvia's Place number 11 for my brows. I'm just going to mix these two together to create the shade that I would like and clean them up. Alrighty, so I went ahead and blended that out. Now the eyebrows are a little boxy right here in the center. I'm gonna go ahead and take care of that later on. <laughs> I like to shade in the, um, the inside of my eyebrows with my foundation, so that's that. I'm gonna go in with the Juvia's Place again, just a little bit on the lid. So I just used a tiny bit of translucent um, Laura Mercier setting powder to set the eyes, just like barely. You can barely even see it, which is what we're going for. So now we're gonna move to the um, eyeshadow. Okay, girls, we're gonna go all the way back with this one. I'm gonna use the Modern Renaissance um, Anastasia Beverly Hills eyeshadow palette um, using the shade Love Letter. Now that it's packed onto my brush, I'm going to place it right in the center and just go ahead and build, build, build. All right, doing a sweeping motion right above the crease, just slightly above the crease to blend it out a little bit. Like so. I'm liking the way that this is looking. Um, I want it a little bit more red, not as red as my outfit, but 
um, this is giving more pinkish, purplish, more definitely more pink, um, a darker pink. So let's go ahead and add some red. For the red, I'm gonna use this uh, Fairy Tales Storybook Cosmetics eyeshadow palette. It opens up. Ah, how cute! Like a little book. Um, let's see. So I'm gonna be using. I'm gonna use this red right here. Exact brush. Same brush. Tap, 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 tap. Lightly. And just build. So now we're gonna go right above the crease and just blend it out. That's it, okay? We want these, just just melting it into the lid. That's all we're doing right now. This is very simple. So um, I'm gonna go back into this right here, this red, and just build it up a little bit more. Now, if you would like to, you can go ahead and add some brown right here at the corner and then blend it down and blend, and blend it upward into the brow, not into the brow, but you know, close to the brow if you would like, um, and do a cute little ombre. I'm not going to do that because I want this to be a very simple look. So we're going to stop right here. Actually, I am satisfied with the way that it looks and we're going to put on our eyeliner. I have a flat head brush and I'm going to go ahead and clean my eyeliner up a little bit so that's why I like to clean mine up because it really helps me have a more precise you know clean cut eyeliner we're gonna blend that out okay we're gonna come back to the eyes in a second Let's move on to foundation, one of my favorite parts. Ah! Using the LA Girl Pro Concealer um, in, yeah, the orange color corrector. Ooh, get it together. I'm just going to um, color correct a couple spots that, you know, I'm not happy with at the moment. You know, some blemishes and whatnot. This mustache. <laughs> I can't find the brush that I really want to use, so I'm just going to use this. Whatever gets the job done. Y'all remember back in the day when we used to lay on the color corrector hard? Y'all, my whole face will be orange. Like, no lie. Alrighty. Up next, foundation, I'm gonna be using my NARS foundation in, I'm not gonna pronounce that out loud and embarrass myself in front of all these folk on the internet, okay? But it'll be in the description box down below. Remember how I said that we're gonna go ahead and blend the middle end with our foundation? So I just like to go right down the center just like this. Up and down, up and down, up and down to blend it out. My favorite concealer of all time has to be the Too Faced Born This Way um, and Butterscotch. Mm, I love this. I just wanna eat it. Like, <laughs> I made it. This is Butterscotch. You know I'm greedy.
contouring with the uh, Fenty with the Fenty Beauty uh, Matchstick and Espresso. I'm gonna use a little bit of setting spray, just like a tiny, tiny bit of setting spray. Contouring with Fenty Beauty Mocha Mami Bronzer. Saharan Blush Volume 2, and I'm just going to mix this color, that color, and that color. Looking good, looking good. Um, as you can see, I didn't put that much blush. You know, I'm not trying to go too crazy. I no longer put um, highlighter on my cheekbones. Um, I don't know. It's just like so 2000 and you know, <laughs> like 16, 17, 18. Like, I think that the highlighter, like heavy highlighter on the cheeks, is like over with. That's just my thing. Like, I don't know. Maybe it's not. I know a lot of people still do it, but I just feel like, I don't know. It, it could be a little bit too much. Like, we already have a lot going on with the face, so, yeah. But I'm just gonna put a little dollop right here. On my nose, just the tip. And then along the bridge. Ooh. Get it together. But you know, it's your face, your highlighter, so you do what you wanna do with yours, you know. This is called a, um, eyebrow top coat from INB and I'm just going to put this on my eyebrows and this right here if you don't want your eyebrows to go anywhere like swimming you know if it's raining and you know if you have a wild night out and you end up falling asleep with your makeup on I promise you your eyebrows are still going to be intact with this right here so if you use if you use the eyebrow gel with the top coat, ma'am, <laughs> or sir, <laughs> you know. I'm telling you, your eyebrows will not go anywhere. Love. When I used to do makeup, I would use this combo right here, and people would always say, what did you put on my eyebrows? Girl, it's been three days and they still on. This right here. You're gonna have to scrub, scrub, scrub. <laughs> telling you so anyway um now that i've done that i'm gonna move back into the eyes and we're gonna do a little bit of under eye um shadow going to use a black eyeliner pencil to just uh, go on my waterline. All right, so the lashes are on and now I'm going to move on to the that I'm so excited for. <sighs> okay, 
which is the gloss. I'm just gonna use some regular old NYX butter gloss um, in cherry pie and put it right on the lid. Easy peasy. I'm just gonna put some on the back of my hand, like so. Not too much, y'all, like, you don't need a whole lot. Oh my God, can y'all see that? <sighs> Calm down, just, <sighs> I'm not even finished yet. <sighs> okay. Oh my God, it's giving red leather. So you're gonna be like making a cut crease basically with the um, with the gloss. Can y'all see this? Oh my god, this is so sexy and perfect for Valentine's Day. Perfect for Valentine's Day. I'm never gonna finish this tutorial. Let me hurry up. <laughs> All right, using a NYX lip liner, I'm just gonna line my lips. Oh, this is in dark brown. So, I'm flicked it. I don't know if I want to do a brown lip or a red lip. Would, would that be too much? Mm. Ooh, girl. Ooh, we looking good. I think I'm gonna go in with the brown. I just don't see why I would do, I don't know. I think like red would be too much. Would it? What about a very light red? What do y'all think? What do y'all think? Hold on. My camera overheated, so I did my lips off camera. I just used the um, Fenty Beauty Hot Cocoa, Hot Chocolate. Fenty Girl, Fenty Beauty Heat. <laughs> hot Chocolate, that's what I used. Um, and I went ahead and filled in my little, I have a beauty mark right here, so I just filled it in with a, uh, with the eyeliner and I'm gonna finish it off with some Morphe setting spray. Oh my God, what do you guys think about the look? Uh, I can definitely see me wearing this um, 
for Valentine's Day. The glossy lids used to be really popular, you know, like back in the day. So I just thought I'd bring it back, you know? Um, I love it. Love. Ugh. If you like what you see, make sure to comment and let me know, okay? Thank you guys so much for watching. Please remember to like, share, subscribe, and comment. I love you guys so much. Enjoy your Valentine's Day.